It is property tax assessment time across our viewing area, and that means the chance for higher taxes. Augusta City leaders already decided to take the rollback rate and not raise taxes. But property assessments on average went up, which does mean higher taxes. The last part of the equation is the school board's millage rate. Our Craig Allison live now from the Board of Education. So, Craig, the school board is on track to raise property taxes. Break this all down for everyone. That's right, y'all. So despite the fact that commissioners and now the Board of Education are looking to take lower millage rates, property assessments aim to bring those annual payments up by about $164 on average. Richmond County says the average price of a home was about $130,000 to $150,000 last year. Now jumping up by 40%, that brings those average homes now to more than $200,000. It, it scares me and it makes me think I'm not going to be able to live in my 70 year old non renovated house. Paul Wheeler came into voices frustration. He says he doesn't feel like the services represent what he's paying in the years that I've lived here. I've not seen better roads, better services. Um, and now from uh, our interaction with uh, one of the schools, it it makes me wonder, you know, what where is this money going? All of it, a domino effect with the rise in property assessments. Commissioners are looking to approve a lower tax rate that's even less than last year. So is the Board of Education. But with the average property assessment jumping 40 percent, about 150,000 to more than 200,000 on average, it's an extra 164 to the annual taxes. Well, I'm a taxpayer, too, here in Richmond County, and I also had an increase, so I would probably have some of the same concerns. Although I would say that this is not the form for those concerns. Um, we, we can't address what another department within the city has done that we have no relations with. But for the time being, it looks like everyone will pay even more than last year. I don't mind paying more taxes um, as long as they're going to something positive. Now, the school board says that their rate still had to be a little higher than what county commissioners would have preferred. That was to take on more health care costs and paying their employees and staff. That being said, the last day to dispute your property assessments was yesterday. In Augusta, Craig Allison on your side. Everybody watching the bottom line on that tax bill right now. Craig, thanks.